Two sets to one. Pabor sa cool smashers. That is our official tally as we get ready for set number four. Pero bago yun, balik ang muna natin ang highlights. Set number three. Pabor, binigay dito sa gitna para kay Risa Sato. At sa pagkakataong ito, binigay naman niya kay Soltones ang bola. Pero nakaabang si Laura Shout. Now, the water defenders had their moments, especially with Jeng Bo Lee. Pero isang total team effort ang nakita natin mula sa Cool Smashers. Galanza getting active. Ito si Kutika showing us her spiking prowess. Ito po ang mga numero ng set number three. Sa 13 spike points para dito sa Cool Smashers, Pito Jan galing dito kay Kutika. And uh, kung makikita natin siyang malaking dahilan kung bakit uh, maaga silang lumamang, nahirapan bantayan ng water defenders. Not even a single block para sa water defenders. They had one in that second set win. They had, I believe, a couple in that first set loss. Something that they have to be able to establish here in the fourth set. Kung hindi, baka matuloy-tuloy sila rito ng cool smashers na ngayon I own, are only one set away from a, probably, you can say, a mini upset laban dito sa ating uh, pace center sa ating kompetisyon ng uh, water defenders. Nakikita natin yung concern sa mukha ni Jenny Keddy kasi nga uh, ayaw nila sayangin yung pagkakataon na makakuha ng outright semis birth. Oo, oh, oh, totoo yun. Tataas ang pressure and I believe they will play uh, the power smashers. Yes, na nanalo kanina. Oo, oh, oh, na ngayon ang power smashers ay nasa limang panalo no? sa apat at apat na pagkatalo so may chance ang umabot sa anim na panalo. With the first serve for the set. Maraming salamat sa uh, inyong pagtutok ngayon. And we are trending also at the number two spot nationwide. Hashtag VVL on ABS-CBN. Maraming salamat po. At Con Ross together with Coach Rodney Sonsano. And we also have Angelique Mato with us to complete our broadcast team ngayong gabi. First point ng ating fourth set, kinuha rito ng water defenders, Risa Sato. Risa Sato. Trying to help out uh, Kedin, of course, itong si uh, Boli, na napakatahimik dun sa third set pagkatapos nagpasabog ng napakaraming punto sa second set. Itong si Boli is actually averaging 16.3 points per match, pero ngayon, 8 points pa lang ang uh, naibibigay niya. Yung 16 na yan, Anton, in her prime. Napakababa niya. Pumapalo ito ng 30, pumapalo ito ng, ng 40. Yung unscoring record sa sa biling ng pagkatagal-tagal. Ang nakadikit lang doon si Eliza, who scored 39 points. Wow, almost. Alright, uh, ito yung mga tao na nagpapatrend sa atin dito. Maganda ang pinapakita ni Rak Rakin as libero para sa Creamline Cool Smashers. Yun ang observation ni Earl. Thank you, Earl. And uh, congratulations. Kasi parang nakaka-graduate mo lang. <laughs> well, ano, eh, parang eh. si Ike Ordas. Oh. Yung parang bomba yung laro. Kuti ka. Nako, galing maglaro. Idol. Serving. Basta Creamline is the best among the rest. Oh, pwede. Ah, pwede. <laughs> From Lucy naman, go Bolly. I love watching my coach play. Your coach? Wow. So, baka, baka naka-experience na, na uh, pwede. maturuan ni Bolly. And from Kench Agustin, Jeremy definitely is the most improved player. Keep it up, girl. Go Water Defenders. On cue. The service line si Sabana. Isa sa mga pambato ni Coach Shaq para sa FU Lady Tamaracks. Good serve by Jerry Tabor to a running Keddy. Good save by Shaq. Antone. Soltones. Free ball. Mayroon para sa Cool Smashers. Cabanos to Galanza. Cabanos. Good save. Kutika. Soltones. Soltones gets the point against Shout and Colleen Bravo. Before the entry of the reinforcements, Redsel Soltones was among the league leaders in terms of scoring. Asama si Lujovi Limprado and of course itong si Eliza Valdez. But now she has to take a backseat at times. 
sa ating mga higante, sa ating mga imports or out to help out our local teams get to uh, the final four. Coming into this match, Sultan is still averaging 14.6 points per match, pero with, with players like the six foot five Shout, at saka isang higante pa. Look at that trace coming from Shout. 5'11 na si Colin Bravo. So, Iiwas mo sa 6'5. Meron din 5'11. <laughs> Questionable 6-footer. <laughs> or doubtful 6-footer. Matangkad din talaga. Goli. Soltones. Sumunta sa kabilang side si Soltones. This time, the two blockers are much shorter. Kanina, 6'5", 5'11", ngayon naman, probably one is 5'6", the other is 5'3", 5'4". Soriano and Cabanos. Cabanos. Soriano had to stretch. Boli. Look at the angle. Soriano na naman. Cabanos. Galanza breaks down the wall. Hindi broad jumper si Gemma Galanza sa preparation niya. Look at how quick she goes. One, two steps. Scoring off the block. Nakikita mo, David slays Goliath in that last point para dito kay Gemma Galanza. This time, Jenny Kenny gets the point for the water defenders. Balikan muna natin si Angelique Mato. Probably the main reason why Bawali Haruwensi or, Je or Jeng has been really excelling in volleyball ay dahil sa ito lang ang kanyang first and only sport. Pero she wouldn't have been able to be playing here in the Philippines if not for Coach Roger Korayev who took her in. Pero hindi lang ito tungkol sa pagiging grateful niya kay Coach Roger na naging tatay niya na dito sa Pilipinas. Pero dahil na rin sa nakitaan doon niya ng potential ang volleyball scene dito sa Pilipinas. Mula nung nagsisimula pa lamang itong lumago hanggang sa ngayon na it's slowly solidifying its existence. And Jeng is still and continuously learning. But eight years of coming in and out of the Philippines, Jeng has found the peace of her home Thailand, sa sinigang natin, which is near the taste of her favorite tom yam. Ang tanong ko siya ni. Dahil sa sinabi mong yam, bukas na bukas din. Sinigang na ulang, income yas. Check. Pero maanghang yung ano yung oh tom yam. Saka sa atin yung sinigang, may sinigang sa Bayabas, sinigang sa Kamyas, ano pa ba? Sa iba, ginagamit sa sinigang Letus. Letus. Oo, oh, nagulat. Tangkong. Boli. Sumobra sa Tom Yang. Yung palo rito ni uh, Jeng, Boli. Masyadong maanghang. Oo, eight years. Pabalik-balik sa Pilipinas. Over 30 Service. years old. Continuing to play the sports that she, that she loves the most, reuniting with her mentor, well, Coach Roger Gurayev. Mas kisi siya sa Deva na Dera, nabasa ko pay, pay tribute time. kay Coach eight. Roger yung Gurayev. Eh. Six, okay, 8 to 6 ang ating talaan. Water defenders lead the cool smashers. Magbabalik po ang PBL dito sa SNA. Maraming salamat muli sa lahat ng mga nakatutok ngayong gabi. Ito po ang aming special SNA coverage ng Premier Volleyball League. Sabi nga nila, start them young. Ito ang ating, uh, balikan lang natin, Coach Ronnie, ang ating enhanced reinforced right. conference format. Ten games per team. Top two seeds, the top two teams will get the two seeds in the semifinals agad-agad. Yung hindi po makakatawit dyan sa semifinals ay maglalaro po ng single round. Tapos we start from scratch. Yep. And then after three games, malalaman natin kung sino pa nga sa dalawang teams, sa apat na naglaro sa quarterfinals, ang sasama sa unang dalawang seeds na tumulit sa semifinals. So, ito na yung huling linggo ng preliminaries. Tapos sa Sabado, magsisimula na po ang quarterfinals. And then the semifinals on June 3. So, ayan po ang uh, schedule natin dito sa PBL Reinforced Conference na talagang... Uh, pinaghandaan namin dito sa SND. Meron na po tayong live stream coverage na na-enjoy ng ating mga fans. Three different camera angles. Meron tayong net view, meron tayong wide view at end zone view. At syempre, mga bagong live stream anchors and analysts or facilitators. Ayun po, Billy Capistrano at si Therese Gaston na nagde-debut 
ngayong gabi. Yes. So since uh, this is Teresa's first time to do this, Teresa, tanong ko sa'yo, how's the experience so far? Hi, I'm really enjoying the experience so far. <laughs> Super galing niya. Ang galing-galing niya, promise. Yeah, I, I, I was looking at you guys from over here. Nakita ko very animated kayo dalawa. Yes. Uh, Therese, I, I know you played recently, um, and you played for Ateneo also. What's the difference, and um, did you ever imagine yourself doing this? Um, I never imagined being um, analyst or what. Pero alam mo, okay lang for me. I really enjoy it. You know, um, based from my experience in the game. Um, yun nga, I, I enjoy watching, so I can give all my best knowledge on what's going on talaga. Uh, Teresa, have you played with so players as tall as uh, <laughs> who, who you are seeing right now, like Kedi and uh, Laura Shout before? Um, not really as tall as them talaga. Siguro, yung pinaka-tall na talaga yung mga teammates ko sa Ateneo, which are not 6'5", ganon. Si Jaja, nakalaro mo, di ba? Um, yes, so, I have... Um, Dati, but not so much naman. Pero iba din yung lakas at yung tangkad nila dito eh. Totoo yan, totoo yes. yan. Coach Ronnie, meron din ako tanong para kay Billy Capistrano. Yan ay kinakabangan ko yung mga tanong niya ano doon eh. Kasi, syempre ako, humingi din ako ng mga feedback sa mga fans. Sinatanong ko, sino ba ang favorite mo na live stream facilitator? At karamihan sa mga nakausap ko, ang sinabi nila, Billy Capistrano daw. Ano mo, tama ka na nga dyan. So Billy, ano ba ang reaction mo sa lahat ng mga positive feedback na binibigay sa'yo? Syempre, you know, it's so different doing live streaming and court court siding as I used to do back in the UAAP and of course he, sa V-League. Pero nakakataba ng puso because I'm continuously learning alongside volleyball greats and of course, you know, <laughs> learning the game because I don't I don't play volleyball. This is my first time doing anything like this and it's it's such a great Five opportunity and I'm so thankful. And we're Three, very four, thankful as well to have you as part of our SNA live stream, live stream team. Great Therese. job, Billy and Thank Therese. You. Thank you. Thanks, Welcome. Coach Thanks, Anton. Doing keep it up, well. keep it up. Doing Thank well, you. ladies. Thank you. Ayo po ang ating live stream team for tonight. Billy Capistrano and Therese Gaston, former Ateneo Lady Eagle. Back to the action. 13 to 8 ang ating talaan. Ang mga Determinado dito, Anton, ang uh, water defenders. Yep, so itulak ang laban sa... Fifth and final set. The stakes are higher para dito sa water defenders compared sa pool smashers na hindi na po makakatawid outright sa semifinals. Sila, kasama ng Philippine Air Force, ay lalaro sa quarterfinals. You have to play three more games. Probably you have to win at least two para makatawid ka sa semifinals kasama yung unang uh, nasa tuktok. Oh, not a good service reception para dito sa ating scoring machine na si Jack Wally. Here's Dao. Flat na flat yung bola, no? Sa pag-contact pa lang ng bola sa braso ni Jeng, alam na niya eh. Alam na niya it was not a good reception. That's why she's talking to Gretzel now. And sinabihan niya si Gretzel na pumunta sa kanyang harapan. Takpan. Oo, oh, takpan. Saluhin. Pero sa ngayon, eh, kalamangan bumaba na sa dalawa. Problemado ang service reception dito ng water defenders. Iisip kasi, iisip, bago pumalo, tumingin muna dun sa bablak. Hindi dun sa rumisip, tapos pumunta sa set, tapos tumahas yung bola. Eh, ganun yung tingin niyo siya eh. Pagpunta, nireceive na, hindi ka naman ang rumisip. Tingnan mo na kung sino yung papaluan mo. Pag pumunta dito yung bola, yes tayo. Sayang eh, napupunta sa hero yung lamang na sa hero. Well, sa tinig ni Coach... Sa tinig ng bosses ni Coach Roger Goreyev, talagang na, concerned, no? yes. Coach Ronnie. Iba na, three straight points para dito sa water defenders. Ayun na ni Coach Roger sana at 13-8. Eh, tumating na sila sa second technical timeout na komportable ang abante. Pero sa ngayon, hindi lang determinado itong water defenders makatabla. Eh, disidido rin itong cool smashers na makakabul dito sa fourth set. Eh, hindi na lumaba. Kumaba rather ang laban. Time and again, si Jeng Boli yung tina-target nila. Probably saying that they are, they have identified her as a probable weak link sa depensa. Cabanos to shout, shout goes, goes down the line. May kita mo kasi may spasyo ang iniwan yung double block dito. They covered the cross court, but the down the line option was open para dito kay Shout. Back set para kay Jeremy Solid Palapana. Yun. Solid yun. Also going down the line. Beating Rakrakin, going deep, itong si Malabanan. 
lead up to two para dito sa water defenders. Jerlene Manaban, serving for Balipur. This is an important stage in this match. Lalo na para sa water defenders ni Coach Roger Goreyev. Shout! Ooh. That's got to hurt. No one was there. She opted to go to a different angle, pero sa kanyang uh, attempted drop ay hindi tumawid yung bola. Two straight Service. points para kay Malaban. Malabanan at sa kupunan ng uh, water defenders. Galanza. The bore to a running caddy. Shout. Binalik dito sa water defenders. Nabor, panibagong pagkakaton. Binigay naman kay Soltones. Rakrakid with the save. Kutika, mula sa back row. Nabor, binalik dito kay Keddy. Oh, that was just a smart play by Jenny Keddy. Against the triple blocks. Now the lead once again is up to four. Magbabalik po ang PBL dito sa S&A. Ayan po, DJ Tronics. You can follow him at IMDJTronics. And you can also follow our all-around and tireless ABS-CBN Sports Analyst, Coach Ronnie Mansano on Twitter. That's at Coach Ronnie M. Yeah, so hindi na mahihirapan ang ating mga fans na uh, hanapin ka on social media, Coach Ronnie. Ang itin ko kasi. You can ask Coach Ronnie any question about the NBA. About the UAP, about the PVL. Right now, we're tackling this Premier Volleyball League matchup sa pagitan ng Cool Smashers at ng Water Defenders. Water Defenders, yung subukan na makapag-force ng isang deciding fifth set coach run. Kanina pa si Jerry Malabanan dito sa service line. At dahil doon, sumampan na naman muli yung abante nila sa lima. Gawin mo ng anim. It's a battle of scoring runs here in the fourth set. No let up para dito sa water defenders. Some unforced errors hurting the cool smashers in their bid to overturn what was once a five-point deficit. Na ngayon ay umangat na sa anim pinakamalaki na abante para dito sa water defenders. Elisa Valdez nagbabalik sa loob ng court. Lapang pawi si Ineng yun. At the ace, nineteen to twelve. Jerry Malabanan hurting. The defense of the Cool Smashers playing one of her best scoring games cool here smashers. in her maiden appearance at the uh, first edition of PBL. Madalas nating mapanood si Coach Oliver Almadro sa Ateneo Blue Eagles. And I've always wondered what type of effect Coach Oliver would have on a different set of players. I had a chance to see him when he coached coach before sa VD. I believe he coached uh, Meralco before. Hindi ako nagkakamali. So, siyempre iba dito eh. Hindi mga estudyante, professional na competition na to. But I, I, I note for a fact that kaya kaya ni Coach Oliver magdala ng mga players at mapasunod ang ating mga season campaigners. Kasi nakakahawa yung energy na dala nitong si Coach Oliver Almadro as we see Gemma Galanza get the point there. Eliza Valdez babalik sa service line playing sparingly in today's match trying to rest that right ankle right para sa grind pagdating sa quarterfinals. And, Naku, ayan po, service ace number 19 para kay Eliza Valdez na yung reinforced conference. Kung nais bumalik ng Cool Smashers dito sa fourth set, ngayon na yung tamang panahon. Valdez. Valdez has been stellar from the service line. 18 service aces, sabi nga ni Anton kanina, for eight matches for uh, Eliza. 
So ngayon, siya na uh, nauna pagdating sa bilang ng mga service aces kasi coming into this match, tabla sila ni Janet Panaga with 18 service aces apiece. Soltones, meanwhile, gets the point para sa water defenders trying to defend this lead and send this match into a fifth set. Soltones overpowering the double block, scoring off. Lot of shout. Good point lead. Send this match into a fifth set for the second time in three days. So, totoo yan. <laughs> so, 15 sets in 48 hours. Ang daming ice pack mamaya niyan. Dao. Sumabay si Kedi. Cabanos. Binigay dito kay Galanza. Could not get the right yes. elevation there. And that was straight to the net for Gemma Galanza. Seven point lead. Para kila Gretzel Soltones, Coach Roger Zorayel continues to encourage Jeng Boli. Cabanos, quick attack para kay Soriano, lumalaban pa ang Cool Smashers dito. Ayaw bitawan ang set number four. Ito talagang uh, certified quicker. Cabanos, low quick set. Soriano beats the double block before na-establish itong sila Kelly. Shout. Hoping that she and her teammates will make some noise here. Galanza popped up by Malabanan. On the second touch, Nabor was there. Pantone, binalik dito kay Nabor. Ooh, ooh. Looks like uh, nakakaramdam na ng fatig itong si Boli. Nagbakal, ano? Oops. Uh, was that a combination play? <laughs> Whatever it was, it was, they will take it. It and, was uh, a broken play, pero... Boli is stomping on her right leg, Coach Ronnie. Pag take-off niya kanina, kita mo, nagbakil yung paa eh. Pero, ang okay naman, but... Kedi finishing off yes, that last player. point for a 7-point lead. Nagkabanggaan sila, pero... Sa tangkad niya, napalo pa rin niya pababa at napatay yung bola. Cabanos, binigay dito kay Soriano. Sato, Boli. Pumapalo pa rin itong si... Jeng Boli. Nabor. Quick attack for Sato, and that is one of the most dangerous combinations ng water defenders. Perfect timing for Risa Sato. And that's uh, familiarity para dito kay Nabor at uh, Sato. Malabanan had to work doubly hard to keep that ball alive and in play. Kedi sends that one to the net. Still a seven point lead. Magandagandang puhunan for the cool uh, for uh, the water defenders. The water Sir. defenders in their last game, one over Perla Spikers in five sets. They're hoping to get another five-set victory in gabi. Free ball. Nabor. Sato! Sato! Strikes Ibang klase talaga itong kombinasyon ng Lady Bulldogs slash water defenders. Good read by Jasmine Nabor. Makikita mo, walang matangkad na blocker sa harap. Sato, eluding itong si Dao. Doon sa kanyang atake. Isa Sato says, Domo Arigato Gosaimas. Dito kay Jasmine Nabor. Lead up to 8, 8 set points. Hawak dito ng water defenders. Cabanos, brigay dito kay Kutika. Water defenders trying to close the set. Nabor lost her balance. Hold on, Nabor. Even the best playmakers have a hard time pag hindi talaga Maayos yung bigay ng bola. Ginawa ng para ni Jasmine Nabor, but it was an infraction that, it, that turned out to be para dito sa Lady Bulldog na ngayon ay uh, primerong playmaker ng water defender. Great effort by Malabanan and Sato there. Kaya lang hindi na ibalik ni Sato ang bola sa side ng Cool Smashers. Coach Roger Goreb looking on. <laughs> So One point so away yeah. from uh, sending this match into a race to 15. Sa panglima, pulling set. Ito sa kasakali. Nabor, quick attack para kay Sato. Sato. And, and we will go to a deciding Bando. fifth set. Water defenders sa Sabax is so a five-set match for the second time in three days. Tuloy po ang laban dito sa Premier Volleyball League. Huwag po kayong alis. Fifth set sa pagitan ng Cool Smashers at ng Water Defenders dito lang sa SNA.